burn back it in I saw be positive Wake up and leave No for them my eye boat machine We on come on Something we bigger than the jam can on Lightning with all them and them young with one and leave them headless no foot to stand on the love Hi, um, this is one of those moments where you're like, I need to sit down, I need to vlog, I need to do something, but then you're like, what should I talk about, what should I, you know, what should I vlog on, and I know, I, I guess it's it's the nature of the art, is there anything like vloggers block, just like there's writers block, I don't know, but anyway, I think... With love, though, love is love. You know, love is a is a universal theme that anybody and everybody can relate to. It has nothing to do with skin, color, or race, nationality, or whatever the case. Because at the end of the day, a person is a person, and whatever a person in the South Pole will or can experience, another person in the East, or West, or North Pole is you know bound to experience also because human experiences are very much the same anyway um i just feel like it's important to remind young girls out there ladies and just everybody in general that sometimes when you're looking for love or to enter into a relationship just try and tell yourself that all you want to do is have a good time try and get in there with the mentality that I'm just gonna go out on a date or get to know this person and have fun I just want to have a good time and then let things you know grow from there or see what happens from there because I have come to realize from personal experience that when you grow up you have this fixed idea and image in your head that you've already created for yourself of what your ideal partner has to be like has to look like this is in terms of physical appearance complexion height how tall they have to be you know being muscular fit sometimes even the shoe size and you know stuff like that um even the size of the eyes the ears you know but then as you grow older some of these things don't matter as much because priorities begin to change and of course when you're a child you think like a child but when you grow up you put away childish um, mentalities so i mean i i just feel like it's best to go in and say i'm gonna have a good time and see what happens from there take it from there don't set your standards way up high above the rooftop you know and i think if it's like that you're you're, you're in for success because apparently it's hard to find exactly what you want the way you you know wanted or thought it would come sometimes you have everything you want in your partner whether uh, your man or your woman packaged differently <laughs> it may come with a pot belly it may come with a person that wears specs and you never even thought you know you'd get a person that wears specs that can't even do anything without their specs and you know you know you just never thought that you'd get a big person or a chubby person at any point or you just never wanted someone skinny and that's actually who you fall in love with in the long run that's you know you get surprised even with yourself because you might just get married to the person you least expected to get married to so i mean these are the mysteries of some of these things but i guess it's part of growing up so just try it out see what happens listen to everybody that comes don't look at a person and say i'd never listen to this person look at another person and say hmm, they don't look like they can make any kind of sense um regarding what i want or what i'm looking for uh don't judge a book by the cover i think it's best to be used in this scenario so i don't know let's not look for love on the outer appearance this is what i learned recently but let's look for love elsewhere because if we get married based on the outer appearance the relationship is bound to fail because it cannot stand the test of time 
yes so we learn well from even our spiritual fathers so anyway i have to check out i'll see you later bye mosquito Yeah.